All right, as long as we're talking about foods, let's go to this. We talk about bagels. I don't know many people who don't like bagels. And if you're looking for the real deal, we're talking the New York style, the authentic bagel, then I have a place for you. And his backstory is pretty cool too. Check out New Garden Bagels. <laughs> I made bagels back in high school. We got blueberry, then and went to the military in the corporate world. I decided to pull back on my roots and decided to open up my own place and make bagels and it's the ball. I know it's just water with a bunch of dough floating in it, but I'm hungry. I need to have roughly 100 dozen done by 5.30 a.m. And throughout the day, probably add another 20 to 30 dozen on top of that. Per 100 pounds of dough, I'll get 40, roughly between 40 and 42 dozen out of each 100 pound. Goodness, and is this just a dry mix? Is that what that is? We add in water now, and then it'll, it'll spin for 15 minutes. Okay, cool, let's do it. The pop shops in Greensboro get from here. It's someone has to be here by between 2 and 2.30 in the morning if it takes an hour for the oven to heat up. That's all right, that's all right. Ow! That thing is hot! That is hot! Come here in the morning, so I leave here about maybe 9, 30, 10 o'clock. Then I'll come back in the afternoon to make sure everything is set for the next day. There it is, sausage, egg, and cheese. Provolone cheese on Asiago, I love this. I, wait, no, 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 photographer Manny, he got something to eat too. Give me that, give me that thing. You get to see the behind the scenes guy. We get to eat. You ready? I'm ready. All right, that's it. You guys come out. You gotta check this out. Mm. <laughs> well, you missed it, but Manning and I were <laughs> Manning and I were like this together. Because oh, it was so good. That place is amazing. It really and is. literally every food story, we were talking about the steak, the bread, the coffee. I'm always hungry. It's almost dinner time. Always. You guys are doing this to me. We're always hungry. By the way, a cool thing about his story. Uh, they're open every single day. Mm -hmm. I mean, Christmas, Thanksgiving, New Year's. Snowstorm. Snow, yes, yeah, snowstorms. We've done live shots from there. He's <laughs> open every single day, and first responders always eat free at his restaurant because he's uh, he was career military right. for a long time. So. And and what time does he arrive to work? Uh, he gets up at two and two. gets in there around two forty-five to three. And they have, as he said, like 26 dozen bagels done by 5.30. Wow. Jeez. Sounds like a former life that yeah. I used to know. Yeah. You know, my favorite part about the story is that Eric had to be there at 6.15 this morning. Had to get up a little early, didn't know, you, buddy? Manny and I complaining, and I said, no, 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 let's think back to about four months ago when we wake up at three every <laughs> right. single day. Yeah, wasn't that bad. Wasn't <laughs> no. that bad.